The news that I have to share with you is going to make your eyes sparkle and your heart beat faster than normal. You have been forced to pinch every cent for years, but now Uncle Sam is finally showing you the money, cold, hard cash that has the potential to save you from poverty. You read that correctly, payments totaling $2,200 are on their way to you as soon as this coming Friday. I am going to tell you whether or not you were successful, as well as how you may make sure that you get every single penny that you are entitled to. You would not want to overlook these essential particulars, which could have a significant influence on your financial future. Hello everyone, and thank you for tuning in to Stimulus Updates, your go-to channel for the most recent news and updates on various monetary and fiscal stimulus initiatives. Let me introduce myself as your host, Ali, and I'm excited to tell you about some recent developments that have occurred. In any case, before we get into the updates for today, make sure that you click the box that says subscribe and that you enable the notification bell so that you are never left out on any information regarding stimulus-related topics. During these trying times, we are here to keep you informed and to give you the power to make decisions. What's up? Let's get right down to business. I am going to share some mind-blowingly great news with you that is going to make people who are living on modest incomes and senior citizens explode with delight. You should be ready because payments totaling $2,200 are on their way to you, and they are slated to arrive just this coming Friday. That's right, in a matter of days, millions of people in the United States who are struggling to make ends meet will have their pockets and bank accounts stuffed with cold, hard cash. We will delve further into the particulars of when and how these installments of $2,200 will be paid or mailed out, beginning with the exact date and time. This infusion of more than $2,000 can be a lifesaver for a great number of elderly people and those with low incomes who are just maintaining their standard of living. It can assist cover bills that are past due rent, groceries, medications, and other important expenses that continue to accumulate. Because of this, it is of the utmost importance that you remain glued to this video and get yourself ready for the forthcoming Financial Freedom Payday. This Friday is going to be a day that you will want to enjoy and look forward to, so go ahead and grab your calendar right now and circle this Friday with a bright red marker. Take advantage of this once-in-a-lifetime chance to alleviate your concerns about money and take a few deep breaths you won't have another chance like this. It is my intention to provide you with all of the information that you require in order to guarantee that you will receive your payment of $2,200 on schedule. We are going to go over all of the essential information regarding who precisely is eligible to receive this cash win for, the all-important payment dates that you need to make a note of, the manner in which the money will be sent to you, whether it be through direct deposit or the mail, and what you could be able to use these funds for with great joy. You just cannot afford to miss out on this money. Thus, it is imperative that you pay close attention to it. For the purpose of determining whether or not you are eligible to receive one of these $2,200 payments, let's begin by reviewing the primary requirements. The first and most important requirement is that you must have been receiving Social Security SSI or SSASDI or benefits for the entirety of the calendar year starting in 2022. Therefore, if you have only recently begun making payments in the year 2023, I am truly sorry to say that it is highly possible that you will be left out in the cold this time around. Your total income from all sources including but not limited to job investments and other sources. Additionally, in 2022, your pensions, taxes, and other benefits must have been below specific levels, which are determined by your tax filing status. $25,000 for the head of household, $20,000 for single filers, and $32,000 for married couples filing jointly are the amounts that are available. However, there is no minimum income requirement, which means that even individuals who receive only a few thousand dollars in benefits may still be eligible for the program if their overall income is lower than the limits that have been set. Depending on your tax filing status, if your total income from all sources in 2022 is less than specific levels, you will be exempt from paying taxes. It's possible that you could qualify for some perks. There are three thresholds, $20,000 for individuals paying their taxes on their own, $25,000 for those who are the head of the family, and $32,000 for married couples filing jointly. In order to be eligible for these benefits, there is no minimum income requirement, which is a crucial point to keep in mind. This indicates that even if you have a few thousand dollars in income, you may still be eligible for the program if your total income remains below the limits that have been stated. In order to guarantee that those individuals who are in genuine need of assistance are provided with the necessary benefits, these income thresholds have been established. The thresholds offer a thorough evaluation of the financial condition of an individual or household by taking into consideration a variety of sources of income, including but not limited to work, investments, pensions, and other sources of income. 
If you suspect that you may be eligible for certain advantages based on your income, it is recommended that you consult with a tax professional or the appropriate government agency in order to understand the particular requirements for the benefits that you are looking for and to evaluate whether or not you are eligible for such benefits. This fight is not being fought just by Senator Sanders. The voices of legislators, activists, and regular individuals are being heard all around the country in support of the cause. They have an understanding of the challenges that people with low incomes and fixed incomes find themselves in. Older people and people with impairments are included. They are aware of the critical nature of the situation and the requirement for prompt and decisive response. With one another, people are demanding responsibility, openness, and results that can be seen and touched. Having said that, let us not overlook the wider picture. The reform of Social Security is not simply about the numbers that appear on a balance sheet. It concerns the lives of individuals. It's about making sure that every single American has the same level of dignity, security, and peace of mind. Regardless of age, background, or circumstances, anyone is welcome. It is for this reason that it is absolutely necessary to be informed, engaged, and proactive. Mainly due to the fact that every single vote counts, every single story is important, and every single voice is heard. Due to the fact that these levels are subject to change, it is essential to remain current on the standards and laws in order to guarantee that you are appropriately determining whether or not you are eligible for benefits based on your income. Seniors and disabled individuals who rely primarily on those fixed government benefits as their primary source of income are the only individuals who are eligible to receive this payment. Therefore, retirees with greater incomes who are drawing more money from other sources, such as investments or occupational pensions, would unfortunately not receive a single penny, regardless of their age. Your income may have surpassed such restrictions if you are a newer beneficiary who did not receive payments during the entire year of 2022. It is with deep regret that I must inform you that you will not get any of these checks totaling $2,200. For those of you who are able to meet the requirements based on your financial situation, however, I would like to provide you with some additional information that you need to be aware of on how and when you should anticipate receiving this money. According to the Internal Revenue Service IRS, payments made through electronic direct deposit should begin to be distributed overnight between this coming Thursday, April 23rd, and this coming Friday, April 21st. Steve, for those individuals who are eligible and his bank information was already on file. In the event that you did not give specifics regarding direct deposit, there is no need to be concerned because physical checks will also begin entering the postal delivery stream this coming Friday, May 21st. April 21st will be the date that is formally indicated on both the checks that are mailed out and the direct deposits that are made. The video lesson for today has come to an end. When I upload the next video, I shall see you all there. In the event that you enjoy the video, if you want to watch more videos in the future, please make sure you subscribe to the channel.